few days ago, Astro AI sent me a portable car vacuum cleaner for the car. It's time to unbox it and finally use it, because today is gonna be a little bit of everything. Oh, wow. It's already so fancy. Carrying case, I feel like I'm not worthy for a carry. Isn't that sad that I feel like I'm not worthy for a carrying case? Maybe I need to speak to someone. This is a vacuum. It's like a shop vac type of thing. Mm -hmm. All right, stop trying to be corny funny all the time. I just exist. Okay. So here's the scoop, or the suck. You said you were gonna stop. My friends at Astro AI said, yeah, you eat a lot in the car, and let's keep that car not filled to the brim with chin crumbs. Chin crumbs? I have a small, tiny little vacuum for like teensy little crumbs now. Ooh, filters. But for the bigger stuff, I need more of a suck. And suck it is one of them. This attachment's gonna come in handy. Look at this brush, it's got a little hand on it. Oh, there we go, for like the upholstery, the seats, and then it plugs right into the cigarette lighter, or as my dad always called it, the cigar lighter. The car drastically needs to be cleaned right now, so let's go eat, knock out a video, and then try this baby out. You guys, good morning. I didn't even say good morning to you yet. Welcome back to Sean's First time eating. This vlog doesn't need a name. What's in a name? A lot. But today, oh today, everything bagel. Hot sauce. Got this in the mail and was very intrigued. A secret handshake food company, if you know, you know. Well, I guess this is one of those situations where I'm not privy or keen to that information. I don't know, so therefore, I don't know. This sauce is an odd color. It looks like food processed, blended, everything bagel, which is not anything anyone ever asked for. I like how it kind of looks like loose cement. Turn it into a hot sauce! Uh, you just drank cement. You just drank cement. Brooklyn, New York, three peppers out of five. We don't think any idea is too crazy. That's why we paired the beloved taste of an everything bagel with a satisfyingly spicy kick. Lucky for us, and you. <laughs> we had a guy named Trevor write our copy. <laughs> the bottle. <laughs> the second cup of coffee was probably a bit much. Get in the room, you two. <laughs> All joking aside, this looks very fun and intriguing and different, and I love the individualism that this sauce is evoking. So today, I'm gonna go to my favorite bacon, egg, and cheese, New York style bagel breakfast sandwich spot here in Chicago. I know that was a lot. And we're gonna put this on it. I saw like Trevor. Trevor's got a job in Brooklyn, so I have nothing but respect for that marketing agency life, you know? I'm at Gotham Bagels, kind of on the coast of Old Town and West Coast. This place makes an egg everything bagel that's out of this world. There's four locations in Chicago. If you're here and you want a bacon, egg, and cheese, get it. On my ordering app, Toast Tab, I just got that my bagel is ready. I like how the last time I did this, it was Zaza's. Also very New York. Is Toast Tab very New York? I can't stress this, this to you enough. Do not leave a camera and stuff in your car, I'm just gonna risk it, you know? I'm a real, <laughs> I'm a sucker for punishment, I don't know. All right, I'll be right back, stay here. I'm not paying for parking. I'm in a flasher zone. Is this guy gonna say something? He works for the building and he kinda gave me a look. Good. You're still here. Some of the houses on this street, this is Dearborn, are just, these are like million dollar like brownstones. Like just look, look at, look at this one. That is like the ultimate flex to me to live in Gold Coast. Cause it's like, you're not in a huge high rise, like impressive view neighborhood like the loop or something the south loop for example you're living in kind of like what is this like the upper east side of chicago like some of these friggin houses dude how do you just have family money or 
Is that like, have you just worked way harder than I have? <laughs> Both. Okay, I'm gonna try this without food first. Give it a fair shake. We've got some fresh new young talent doing some things that I know you haven't heard before. I mean, it really does look like blended everything bagel. Does it not? Whoa, it smells like salad dressing. It smells like Italian dressing. What? Garlic, vinegar, lime juice, poppy seeds, onion. Okay. Taste test, here we go. One, way hotter than I thought it was gonna be. Definite scorpion pepper in there. That is just a burn unlike anything else. It's gritty. It has like the crunchy kind of like coarse seeds from like the everything bagel. And it's really salad dressing-y. Very garlicky. It tastes like a poppy seed dressing mixed with an Italian dressing. So how is this gonna work on a bacon, egg, and cheese? It suggests having it on chicken, pizza, and then actual bagels. Someone had to do it. No, you didn't. You're trying to get money for being weird. Gotham's hot sauce. Dining room table installed. This could use a good vacuuming. I already see a bunch of crumbs and stuff from other videos and I'm excited. That's how you know I'm an adult. I get excited for vacuums. Let's open this baby up. The deli paper, smell, ooh, the cross section. All right, I'm gonna try to do this on the phone so you can see what I'm seeing. Watch the cross section. Ooh, oh, it fell. <laughs> Look at that thing, the egg everything bagel with the over easy egg juicing. This is the best bagel in Chicago, the egg everything from Gotham. Look, look at the beautiful like orange color. This thing is visually delicious. I'm getting crumbs everywhere. I knew this was gonna work out well. <laughs> Putting this video with, with the vacuum. What a good excuse. And then check out the bottom there. Some of the seeds, stuff is flying off the bagel into the car. But there we have it. All right, there's the bagel, Sando. There's the sauce. Really dumping it on, like. Everything bagel hot sauce on an egg everything bagel in Chicago, Illinois. Giddy on up. Okay. Yolk everywhere. Okay. Wow. By itself, kind of weird. On this, very good. It accents. You don't, it doesn't taste like Italian dressing anymore. I'm gonna put a lot on it. It looks like I poured cement on a bagel. Mmm, so interesting. That's really fun. Heatness has so many good sauces and so many weird ones. I say if you like spice and everything bagels, I'm assuming it's kind of a lot to get it. Heatness kind of, as a bigger company now too, charges a lot for sauces. That's really good, damn. I feel like my eyes watering. I mean, I did use a fourth of the bottle on a half a sandwich. <laughs> Great with coffee. I have not researched this on their website. It's 12 bucks a bottle, plus shipping. 211 reviews, it's got a 4.8 review on Heatnest. A two pack for 22 bucks. Their packaging is so pretty. I get paid nothing if you get it. I have no affiliation with them. I'm just trying it. It's a damn good breakfast. I'll tell you what, that hot sauce, the fact that Heatnest is a big company now and is still selling sauces for like kind of a lot, this bagel sandwich was $13. This stuff's gonna last you a lot longer than this sandwich is. <laughs> okay, this time I'm gonna pour it right on the edge of the bagel, like where it's cut. Almost like where you dip. If you were dipping, that's how it would look. Very highly concentrated. That's really good. If I had it without knowing what it was, I don't think I'd know it's everything bagel, but it accents this really well. Let's get some more cement. See ya. Where's the best chain bagel place? Brugger's? Panera? Einstein's? Definitely not Starbucks. Dunkin'? I don't know. All right, this was really fun having this today. Breakfast sandwiches are my favorite sandwiches, and breakfast bagel sandwiches are my favorite type of breakfast sandwich, therefore my favorite sandwich. Last bite. Mmm!
Now that there's even more seeds all over this car than there was before. I'm forever unclean. <laughs> Let's see if this vacuum has enough skills, enough sucking power to be my daily driver of a vacuum for this car. <laughs> this cord stretches all the way I have so much cord. I could go, I, if I had a bus, I could go all the way to the trunk and then two more cars. Take this off and put on the Lionel hair. Get her. these lines. See, this is great for me because I don't have like a vac, I don't have a garage that I can just like pull up my car into and like use my house vacuum. And I'm not gonna be running my like Dyson to and from the car. Like I wanna have one in the car. This is perfect for that. I mean, that looks like I did the couch inside. It's, it really does work. Like that, this worked very well. This attachment, fantastic on seats. I also noticed it's got a blue light and then more of like a white white light on it uh, to get in here when you can't really see and then also just for at night okay once again I don't get paid at all if you buy one of these I'm just letting you know if it's good for your car if you live a lifestyle like I do it's only $17.99 on Amazon so I'll drop the link below it's $17.99 Also, for people where like your car gets a little dirty and then you're gonna have like someone jump in your car like impromptu, to have this in the trunk would be pretty clutch. Okay, Astro AI, thank you for sending that. Delicious food today, that hot sauce delivered. Got coffee, this is fantastic. Start to the day, a good morning. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. Good morning, good morning. All right, on with the day, onward and upward. Everything bagel hot sauce up, everything bagel hot sauce down. Let's go. You just drink some in. <clears throat> Why? Yeah, try and go further. Try and go farther than ever without a burner. Feeling like I never quit moving, I am a learner. And learn that the higher you get, they want to earn you. But I got to keep moving. I know what the mission is. I on a prize, man, I know what the vision is. Train for the fight, man, I'm doing conditioning. If I fall down, man, I'm going to get it.